Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Browden. Welcome to another Run Disney vlog. This weekend is Wine and Dine Race Weekend with Run Disney, and I am going to be taking y'all along for all of the fun adventures. Um, Caitlin and I are running the half marathon, and I just got to the expo, gonna pick up my bib, gonna look at some of the merch, get our shirts, all of that. Um, I am waiting for Kate to meet me right now. She did a doctor's appointment, so we drove separate. Um, and I'm not gonna lie, I might fall asleep in this car. It's like five o'clock. Uh, I've been up since 1.30 because I had a overnight shoot for work. We're doing good, um, but I'm really excited. Today is actually not the first day of the expo. Typically we do come the first day, but I never really care about like getting any of the merch or anything. And since we weren't doing the 5K, like we didn't need to be here the first day. So we're here on the second day. So hopefully it's a little bit less busy. The parking lot doesn't look very full, um, but it is getting to be like, you know, if people are coming like after work, like we are, then I don't know, it might pick up a little bit, but I think it's open until seven. I'm going to cross my fingers because if it closes at five, that is so sad for us. Um, but yeah, Kate will hopefully be here in like five, 10 minutes and we're going to head in. I hope you're excited because I love run Disney and I'm excited to take y'all along. I feel like I wear this shirt every time I come to the expo. Every mile is magic. Um, this is from Magical Castle Embroidery, code Bron 10 if you would like to match. You ready for a run Disney weekend? Woo! We have arrived at ESPN, Wide World of Sports. There's our medal over there. There okay. she is! And I'm gonna make your medal! I'm gonna make you take a picture on the ground laying next okay, to Okay, perfect. The half marathon thing. Always do. Bron, what's this? My medal! Cute! And you come back and I have my bib. Yeah, seriously. Bring it in, bring it in. Bring it in, bring it in. Okay, signing for waiver. We have these, but they don't have the like specific race ones. Sad, but we're gonna go and pick up our race bibs and then we'll head over here and get our shirts and such. It is empty in here. Oh, that's cute. We got our bibs. I'm 93. Okay, is one number above me. There it is. I'm so excited. I told Bron she has to get down on the ground for the iconic. Uh, yeah, one, two, three. Cute. Sunny. It is very sunny. Did Good it. job. This is cute. It is cute. It's got all the little. It's a little bit more out banners. of the way. Not banners. What are these? Like icons? I yeah. don't know. They normally have them out on the main walkway, but. But I feel like that's like a safety hazard. Yeah, true. I always like coming in here to where the like vendors are, but it always like really stresses me out. Why? It's just so busy and there's so many people. It's not as busy as normal. Do you need a free body armor? That's kind of fun. It's not as busy as it normally is, but it still is crowded. We're gonna get our shirts and then maybe look around like a tiny bit. Fit to Run is the store I get my running shoes from and they always have the cutest shirts. Wait, speaking of shirts, Ron. Show us the shirt. Which they one? Just, they just got. Oh. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> We just picked up our shirts and Braun forgot. It's yellow. Don't love the yellow, but it's fun. I it's cute. I always get the men's because it's not a v -neck. V neck Yeah, you don't have to, you can get whatever shirt you want. You can yeah. get what, men's, women's, you can get whatever size. Those I are wish all it was like maybe purple and I wish it was short sleeves and then maybe I would wear it. So fun fact, I didn't talk about this. Um, normally me and Kate are really good about like having like a costume or at least like a theme. Yeah, we don't have that this year. <laughs> So I have nothing to wear. I mean, I have a lot of athletic wear, but I just wanted to look and see if there was like, I don't know, something cute that I could wear. I know. I was thinking either that or I like the Miles and Magic. It's a little bit more, not just a half. Look like a beauty, run like a beast. You know, they have a lot of Christmas ones. This one I think is funny. Jog for the Nog. Run, run, Where's Rudolph. The finish wine. Oh my God, that's so silly. Wait, Best race ever. I want to. Secret, secret. It's not a secret. We're going to the post race party. You get free tickets if you do the half marathon. Oh, and um, I got like a fifteen dollar gift card. Yeah, I got a gift card too. A fifteen dollar gift card, and you get free tickets included with your race. And it's like a hundred dollars to go to this thing. So what a steal. So I like this one. However, I feel like I wouldn't wear it again. 
and I want this one, but it's not cropped, and I don't love that. And for $31, like, I don't know. I want to actually like it. That's sad for me. After this, we're getting champagne. Good one. What's back here? Are those shorter? No, they're all the same. That is so sad for me. Dang. This is our medal. And it swings and has Bruno. I think that's so cute. <gasps> oh my gosh, this one is so cute. Look, did you know this lit up? It's got like a hole. Whoa, okay, surprise. We're doing Dopey this year too. These are so fun. I will say though, like this is kind of lame compared to the other, to like Prairie previously. I like it. I mean, it lights up, it's cool though. I like this one. Chip and Dale. I don't think they move. They're, oh, yeah, they do. They go up and down. I can't really do that. They also go up and down. Move on this one. Spin. And then the middle spins. That's so cool. Yeah, that's pretty. Yeah. We are unfortunately not doing Princess this year. And I am oh, very thanks. sad about not getting this medal. Like yeah. I wish I was doing it just for this medal. Well, I need like an aerial. I just didn't love the art style. We were already doing Dopey, yeah, like, frozen. we just, I've, I've spent a lot of money on Run Disney. <laughs> this one is cool though. Okay, but like, I have this life goal of getting all of the princesses, like, a medal of each of them. I don't have an Ariel, I don't have a Rapunzel, and I don't have a Frozen. No, I do have a Frozen, I don't have an Anna and Elsa. Yeah. So, I could, I could knock out three if we were doing it. It just came, like, registration was like pretty soon after Dopey, and Dopey was a pretty penny. So like, yeah. It just wasn't the air, but I am really, really sad about not getting that frozen medal because it's so good. Everyone say bye, Kate. Bye, Kate. Um, we actually decided not to go and look at the like regular Run Disney merch just because I knew I wasn't gonna want to buy anything, and it's already six o'clock. Like I said, I have been up since 1:30 a.m., so I am very tired um, and I'm hungry. So gonna go home. Instead, uh, I'm gonna try and piece together something to wear for this race, and I will see y'all bright and early on Sunday morning to run a half marathon. Good morning. Who's ready to run a half marathon? You ready? Whose idea was this? <laughs> I'm gonna have a great. My lamp's still going off. It's gonna be a great time, but yeah, these wake up calls, not it. It's, what time is it? My clock says it's three. It's not, it's two. Um, daylight savings ended in the night. So we got an extra hour of sleep, which was nice. And I feel like I did get a decent amount of sleep, but like, I think even if I had gone to bed at noon, waking up at 2 a.m. still sucks. <laughs> but it's time to start. Getting ready so we can go run. All right, we are running out the door. I had a bagel. I have on my very loose Isabella look. Thank you very much. We gotta go, chat with you in the car. You ready? Yeah. All right, we have made it to Epcot. It is 2.59, so the corrals are getting ready to open. I gotta put my bib on, and from here on out, see you on the phone. Goodbye. Bye. Good morning from Epcot. Arrived. Everyone's getting their selfies. Are you excited? Yeah. Yay! Very complicated way to get to the start line, but we're on our way. We're in our corral. They're teaching us samba. Galloway. Carissa Galloway, aka like my favorite part of these races. She's coming out now, but I am running to the bathroom. We're already in our corral. I just we're not gonna start running for another like hour and I just feel like I'm gonna have to pee really bad. There's nothing worse than running when you have to pee. So we can use the bathroom. Corral is filling up. The start line is over there. We are in Karasi. It's chilly. We're at the move. They just started sending people out. They've done like three waves. We're headed to the start line. We're moving again. This is the last time you're gonna see Kate for a minute because we're running separate today. Sad. But it's gonna be great. Yeah, we're gonna see each other at the finish line. We probably have 
don't know, a couple more groups ahead of us. I feel like there's probably only like five groups ahead of us. We're gonna start soon. See you on the course. Three, two, one, go! I don't know if you can see it, but it's the three fairies. Aurora and Prince Philip. That's crazy. It's a lot of people, but we're running. We're in a few. Playing my favorite song. We are one mile in. Feel good. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. First water shot. Thank you, Cheers. Captain Hook, Mr. Smee, and their bar jump. That's cool. Making our way into Epcot. Oh, it's our first park. Feeling good. Oh, we, <laughs> we made it into the park. I'm making a pit stop in Norway to go to the bathroom. So I'm going to use the porta potty. Mission accomplished. Time to get back on the course. Oh, we made it to mile two. Taking a walking break through Italy. So pretty. Lots of photo pass out, which is always, I'm glad they're here, but I feel so awkward taking photos. Goofy, Donald, and Daisy. I don't know what they're dressed as, but they're cute. All the characters have fairly long lines. And we have our next water stop. Thank you. You're welcome. It's cold outside. I'm sweating. There's a line for somebody over there. I think it's Pluto. Look at your bugs. There's a lot of like random characters all together. Cute. We're backstage at Epcot. Next stop, Boardwalk, and then Hollywood Studios. One thing about me, I will be walking every incline. <laughs> so pretty. I see the mile three sign. We're almost there. It's Louisa. Cute. So cute. Mile three. So pretty. Love. We've completed a 5K. Kate is gonna be so excited for Fiki and Tavon. The best stop. Power rate stop. Oh my gosh, stop it. I'm gonna meet him. His line's not that long. I can believe I met Duffy! I think that's the first time I've ever met him. He's so cute. Alright, we're almost Hollywood Studios, passing the Skyliner right now. I apologize that all these clips have been like absolutely terrible and so shaky, but what are you gonna do? Uh, Hollywood Studios! I'm so excited to run through here. Every time I've run through studios, it's just been like Sunset and Hollywood Boulevard. Today, we run like all the way through. Galaxy's Edge, Toy Story, everything. So I'm very excited. We're in studios! So fun. I love this. The bumper and it's funny. Cute. So cute. This is so cool. I wonder if they'll have any Star Wars characters out. That'll be fun. Trying not to like look at my watch or really pay attention to my time. I'm starting to get tired. We're almost five miles in. Doing good. Definitely walking more than I was in the beginning. But that's okay. I'm gonna finish and that's all that matters. Just be careful out there. There's stormtroopers everywhere. You never know where they pop up. Again, one thing about me, I don't care how steep the incline is. I'm walking it. We're coming into Toy Story Land. There's a character over here, I think. Ah, oh, Woody and Bo Peep. Cute. They're so fun! Took a little jumping trick. Um, head out to Toy Story Land, I think down by Launch Bay. And fun fact, the building right there is my office. Sun is rising, the playing family Madrigal. And Minnie is feeding. She's so cute. Cheers. So mad! Alright, we're photographers. And it is Christmas on Sunset Boulevard. So cute. Walking breaks, so I can actually show you how cute it looks. The stars, the tower. Somebody's over here. Who is it? Aw, Eeyore and Pooh Bear. They're so cute. Aw, poor Eeyore. Same dude. Made it to mile five, right in front of Tower. Whew. I think we're headed out to studios now. This is cool. We're running up to Fantasmic. Here we go. We're also coming up on a Powerade water stop. Thank God I need it. Gucci Bears! That's so cute. 
breaking into my energy twos. Give us more energy. We're headed onto the road for the next like literally eight miles. I think mile 12, we're back in Epcot. But for now, highway. Whoa! Unpopular opinion, as boring as it is, I really like running on like the road. Obviously it's way cooler to run through a park, but there's so much space. I don't feel cramped. It's just cool. Coming past Coronado. We got some volunteers. Those weren't volunteers, they're just spectators. I'm just tired, but we're coming up. I have six. Almost halfway done. Woohoo! Coming up on Pistard Beach. I don't know where we turn around. I don't see anybody going a different way, but we have another Powerade water stop. Thank gosh. It's Clarabelle. I have to stop and get a picture of their brigade. I just met Clarabelle and Horace. They're so cute. You already know. Walking this hill. That's a big one. Mile seven. Over halfway there. Such a pretty day. Nick and Judy. They gave us some square beans, which I don't need right now, but gave about two more miles. Which I come. We're almost to mile eight. They have Jack out. That's a cool one. Alright, passing mile nine. And it's a buggy. Love that. Another water stop. I'm not gonna lie. Probably shouldn't think that. It's almost not feeling great, but we persevere. Time to run. Mile ten. That lamp was in the joke. It's running directly into the sun. <laughs> That's so cute, Carl and Doug and Russell. Oh, Made it to my 11, we're getting close. Breaking up in the sport beans, I'm tired. Oh, I had to take my shirt off, I'm still sweating. Less than two miles left, we're almost back in a pot. I'm tired, but obviously I feel good. I feel proud, let's do this. Okay, that is cool. Um, like dancers from the parade. Good deal. How do I do? Get up, Miss Bronwyn. Thank you. Mile 12. One more mile. Thank you, Bigman. You mind. Alright, less than a mile left. I want to finish strong, so I'm going to put my friend away, and I'll see you. What's up, my medal? We did it. Thank you! Look oh, how cute! Oh my gosh, I love it! Stocking up on beverages. I got my medal! We did it! I got my cutie medal. I'm gonna sit, eat my little box of stuff that they give you, and wait for Kate to finish. We did it! Woo! We, we did, did it. it! You did it! It, it worked. worked! And look at the back of this. I think that's so cute. It says, the magic is in you. And then on the front, I didn't really show this um, while I was waiting. This is the front, and then can you push her? Secret, secret. Secret Bruno. We don't talk about Bruno, okay? We don't talk about Bruno. Um, I had a blast. That was so much fun. It was so much fun. You're tired? I'm tired. Yeah. It was so much fun though. That was a good race. I didn't mind the course. No, no, no. There was a I lot of people either. that were like, this course sucks. Like just like the way that they have you run and where you run, whatever. Like it was a lot of highway and all of the highway was like at the end. But, but like that was, I like running on the highway. You have more space. I don't, it's not that I like running on the highway, but I think that we stayed close to Epcot. It always, it felt easier not easier yeah. but shorter because it's like when you're in magic kingdom and you leave magic kingdom you're like god that is so far you still have like half the race and you're just yeah. like god i just have to run to epcot like it's gonna be forever but yeah. here it's like i can see epcot that's right there even it's though right I have there to do a three mile loop that's fine it's I, right you there you don't think about it because like i can see epcot yeah you know so well, yeah i, I think it too i think also that as fun as it is running through the parks and i still want to run through the parks obviously like i think we did less than a mile to get through studios that like, yeah. I think the time goes by faster running on the highway because it's like this long stretch and you're like, well, I just did two miles on this one road. Yeah. I don't know. I 
Is it the best course I've ever done? I don't know, but like, I liked it. I, I thought it was I good. I liked it too. Like, I love, I love running through Magic Kingdom. Like, running down Main Street is my favorite part of yeah. that course. And I was sad when I saw that that wasn't the course. Yeah. But I've done that five times. Like, I'm it was a fun over to it. do something it's, different. I know we're like running. I'm like, I have different. no idea where I'm going right now. I know. I was like, oh, I've never ridden. I've never uh, run by Coronado before. Yeah. Sorry. There's a medical bike behind us. Uh -oh. um, I think they're okay. Oh, she's a Christmas tree. Oh my God. That's so cute. so cute. Oh, oh, she was on the screen at the beginning. Um, we are going to oh, yeah. head home and maybe take a bath. Maybe take a nap. Do some and stretching, some, stretch. some rolling. Yeah, and get ready to come back to Epcot for the big post race party today. I'm in, so excited. In literally 12 hours. We'll be back. I can't believe we're going to Epcot in 12 hours. That's yeah. Crazy. That's fine. That's fine. All right. We'll see you later. Bye. Bye. I have good news and I have bad news. What's the good news? Let's start with the bad news. Oh, okay. The bad news is um, we can't make it to the party. We're really busy. The good news is I get to go to sleep. <laughs> um, basically, uh, I have not just been sitting around the house in this metal. I did just put it off for this. Um, so That's why we're not going to the party tonight. Why? The big yawn. Yeah, so basically, okay, here's our thought process. Right now, the party starts at 10, which already... PM. Yeah, which already is, like, my bedtime. Um... So we were going to leave here at like 9.15. What time is it right now? Like 9? 8.51. Um, yeah. So already it was like, oh my god, that's so late. But like, you know, it's going to be cool. Like, it'll be worth it. We didn't buy these tickets. Like, it was included in our race price. Like, that. Like we should go. Whatever. Well, we also have just been up since 2 a.m. 2 a.m. And like, we wouldn't get home even if we were only at the party for like an hour, like it'd probably be like midnight by the time we got home. And then like shower, get ready for bed, whatever. Like we will have like literally been awake for 24 hours. And that's just not the vibe, you know? Cause we both have work in the morning. Yeah, we also, today's Sunday. Like we both have to go to work tomorrow. <laughs> I literally have an overnight for work tomorrow night also. So like, oh, I just can't make it. it was just like not, it just wasn't gonna happen. And then it's like, okay, what is happening at this event? You know? So we did get a $15 gift card in the mail, which don't worry, I will still be using. I hope that we can use that. Like it doesn't like expire to mark today. Even if it does, whatever. Again, included in the race price. It was all just icing. But there was a special cocktail, but you have to buy it. Like there's no, like you know like after hours events, like you get free popcorn and free ice cream and all that, like we weren't getting any of that. So it's like, okay, so we're just spending the night in Epcot, which is fun and great, like love Epcot, don't get me wrong. But like, what are we gonna be doing that's different than just like any other day at Epcot? You know, like what's, why, why am I dragging myself out of bed? for this, right? Oh, good news. It doesn't expire until the 12th. So we just have to spend $15 at Disney this week. Perfect, can do. Um, but it was like, okay, the thing I was most excited for was to ride Guardians, but like, I could go ride Guardians tomorrow. Like it's not, I don't know, there's nothing like special about tonight. It was just like, oh, it's gonna be open late for us. Um, and then, Oh, it's just like they have that cocktail. All the booths are open, I think. And then they have special characters. And by special, I don't even know what that means. Like, if it's going to be, like, a bunch of rare characters or if it's just, like, kind of regular people, but there's just more of them. But also, like, how many characters did we see on the course today? Quite a bit. But, like, I don't know. I, it just doesn't... I've been rambling for five minutes, but basically it just didn't seem worth it for the amount of sleep that we are currently running on and She's would be losing by going to the event. I am really sad because honestly, I was really looking forward to this, but I was just like, can't make it. I just can't. So instead, I'm gonna go take a shower. <sighs> and I, 
I'm gonna go to bed. Maybe I'll sleep in my metal, just like this. Yeah, basically, I'm sure the event is like super, super fun. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying that like it's not a good event. Just, we need to go to sleep. Yeah, I wish it was like they shut down Epcot early and it started at like seven. Cause we could get an Epcot, I think, starting at five, right? Which like, if you don't live here, like, that's awesome. Like, you know, you get a, a solid evening at Epcot, but like, because we live here, I don't know. And again, had I actually purchased these party tickets, like, I would be there. But like, we didn't do this. I didn't even know we were gonna get tickets until I like, got an email about it. And I was like, oh, that's fun. Um, But like, it was more about doing the actual race and the party was just like a cool thing but it's just not meant to be and there will be other half marathons and other post-race parties that maybe we will go to thank you so much for watching i hope that you enjoyed this video i love run disney i hope that disney's biggest fan. i am run disney's biggest fan that was my instagram caption and my tiktok caption original um i gotta go Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see y'all again real soon. Bye!